obviously. Look, we've just got to grit our teeth and do it. Tonight, when we get back to the common room, we'll both have partners. Agreed? Agreed. Oh! oh. Potter, what are you doing wandering the corridors at night? I was sleepwalking. He too was exceedingly arrogant, strutting about the castle. My dad didn't strut, and nor do I. Excuse me, sir. Where's Professor Lupin? That's not really your concern, is it, Potter? You were seen by no less than seven muggles. Do you have any idea how serious this is? If that is the second time you've spoken out of turn, Miss Granger, are you incapable of restraining yourself, or do you take pride in being an insufferable know-it-all? He's got a point, you know. Five... Sir, it's Quidditch tomorrow. Then I suggest you take extra care, Mr. Potter. Loss of limb will not excuse you. Honestly, Professor Snape, I think it did more damage to us. Silence! The both of you would be on the train home tonight. As it is, they are not. Then again, maybe some of you have come to Hogwarts in possession of abilities so formidable that you feel confident enough to not pay attention. I will be writing to your families tonight and you will both receive detention. And I suggest that we all return, return to the feast. feast. And with Dumbledore gone. Good afternoon. Uh, oh, oh, oh. We were just... You want to be careful. People will think you... up to something. I just know. You just know.